All right, back home, Massachusetts General Brigham pulling their physicians from Holy Family Hospital in Methuen, also in Haverhill as well. Now, this comes as their parent company here, Stewart Healthcare, is considering closing down several hospitals amid a, a dire financial crisis. NBC 10's Jericho Tran joining us live from Brighton to explain this one. Jericho. Yeah, well, I've been speaking to state lawmakers for the past couple days now because this is a huge situation. And today I learned that Stewart Healthcare is considering closing four hospitals. St. Elizabeth, where I'm at right now, as well as the Holy Family Hospitals, where Mass General Brigham announced they pulled all of their physicians today, which is now a huge concern. That's troubling. I, I certainly understand uh, why, why they, they had to do that, but uh, it doesn't make the, the task any easier. Massachusetts General Brigham tells NBC10 Boston the decision to pull their physicians from Holy Family Hospital came after hearing surgical equipment may not be available. So we're still trying to review the viability of some of these hospitals. And as Holy Family scrambles to reschedule surgeries and procedures. Hopefully those patients can get the help that they need nearby. Stewart Healthcare is considering closing them down, along with Neshoba Valley Medical Center in Ayr, St. Elizabeth's Medical Center in Brighton, and Norwood Hospital. They were, you know, seeking to exit the uh, Massachusetts healthcare market for all nine hospitals, but these these four were in the urgent category. Despite receiving nearly $150 million from the state over the last few years. Even notwithstanding that support that we provided, uh, we received no notice that they were $50 million behind in their rent. Now state officials believe the looming closure may limit inpatient critical care as well as maternal and newborn health services in eastern Massachusetts. What the plan is, but again, our focus is going to be on making sure that patients across this state, including anywhere where there is a, a steward facility, have access to care. Now, this all happened on the same day that the president for the Holy Family Hospitals in uh, Haverhill and Methuen stepped down. I'm told by a Stuart, Stuart Healthcare spokesperson that he stepped down for personal reasons. But back to the closure of those four hospitals. Uh, hospitals need to give 120 days notice before shutting down. Uh, they need to give that notice to the Department of Health. So far, no notice has been given. In Brighton, Jericho Tran, NBC10 Boston.